Governor Parson promised millions of dollars in cuts to the state budget if lawmakers don't strike a deal on a health care tax. ABC 17's news anchor Lucas Geisler is live at the state capitol. Lucas, Parson gave lawmakers until noon tomorrow to get a plan in place. That's in order for him to potentially call a special session on the issue, Zach and Deborah. In order to get that, though, he says he needs a plan in place to know that a bill on the federal reimbursement allowance will pass and be renewed for this next fiscal year. So what is this allowance, this FRA? It's essentially a health care provider tax that places like hospitals and nursing homes pay to the state in order for the state to get money from the federal government to really help operate Medicaid. It is one of the biggest funds in which Medicaid in the state operates on, bringing in billions of dollars a year. That got held up this session here at the General Assembly after some Senate Republicans wanted the FRA to no longer cover certain contraceptives. Now, on that issue, claiming that it is essentially a pro-life issue on why they didn't want that to cover contraceptives and to have those FRA payments on them. Now, it has brought the whole thing really to a halt here, and Governor Parson says if that FRA is not renewed, that it's going to be felt across the state budget. It's millions of dollars in withholding starting July 1st, including millions from higher education and from transportation. We'll, of course, be following up on this uh, throughout the night. I've asked Senate leadership if they've reached any sort of deal, what the latest is on their plans to get a deal in place. We'll be reporting on that throughout the night. Reporting live here in Jefferson City, Lucas Geisler, ABC 17 News. Thank you, Lucas.